the horses procession popularly known as Daba is being celebrated in Dutse Emirates in three phases with each having a whole day dedicated to it. These processions last for two days after the Eid al-Fitr prayer was observed. <laughs> Firstly, the Emir returns to the palace on horseback in a company of hundreds of other horse riders appeared in a colorful traditional attires to the admiration of his subjects. The procession, a carnival-like, is usually arranged in the order of hierarchy amongst the council members of the Emirate. In the second phase, the Emir pays homage to the state governor in company of all districts and village heads, among other title holders in the Emirates. Interestingly, the Emir also tours the state capital acknowledging cheers from the residents as he rides on the streets in the city. <laughs> that is the long-standing tradition in the Emirates. However, there is a silent benefit in this kind of event that attracts people from all walks of life despite their religious or ethnic backgrounds just to catch a glimpse at the elegant display of culture. Among those that grace the festival are the members of the southern parts of the country community in Duti, who say to the fact that this event indeed foster unity amongst Nigerians. <laughs> We thank our traditional leaders for the prayers they make for God to grant us peace in this country. May God grant us peace and prosperity in Jigawa and Nigeria as a whole. The happiness is everywhere. So this is an important milestone for us. And also this is showing to us that there is peace and security in Jigawa. Jigawa happened to be one of the most peaceful states and that unity and peace and stability that we have in Jigawa does not happen without the commitment of our responsible leader, the governor of the state and the support of the traditional institution. We are partners in solidarity, we are partners in peace and unity of this state and this country generally. And anybody that in any way, in any place that is calling for the disunity of this country, we are unanimously saying that we are not part of it and we will not be part of it. We say united we stand, divided we fall. So there is need for unity for us to stand in Nigeria. And that's what we have been praying, that God will grant us that unity. Indeed, in this gathering of people from within and outside Jigao State, one sees nothing but peace and love for one another. <laughs>